Hello everybody, welcome back to Max or Ray. This will be the final, the official final, final episode of Mix or Ray on the channel. So honestly, I'm a little reluctant to get started because I played this game last year, doing it again, and now it's it's, it's gonna be finished. I'm not gonna play it again. I'm gonna miss this music. I mean, I can always talk myself, but still. So, yeah, final, final episode. We're going to get the final bad ending, which we haven't gotten yet. And then it'll be over. That'll be it for Mixel Ray. But next week we'll have Yandarella, another game by the same guy. Ah, the rain. The rain that we've all become so familiar with. I hear sirens. Ah, the sirens that we've all become so familiar with. Except we haven't because we can't hear them. I can't move my body. Ah, the body. The body we've all become so familiar with. It's pitch black in front of me. Anyway, give us that honey milk home slice. Come on. Honey milk. Bad ending for honey milk. I'm excited to see this. Day one awakening. The day that we are all so familiar with. There she is. Ah, adorable. Oh, you're awake? Yes, I am, Rakana. Hmm? What's up, bro? Bro, yeah, sure. I can't remember anything. Where am I? Who are you? Who are you? Wait a minute. Who are you? Huh? Oh, there's that expression that I do so adore. Do you have, like, amnesia or something? Just because you're blonde doesn't mean you have to say like. You haven't forgotten about me or anything, right? Yes, yes I have, like, totally. No way, no way, no way, no way! There's no way you've forgotten about me, right? Well... You're a disgusting MMO addicted neat hermit, and I'm your beloved little sister. Yeah, sounds like it. Your moe moe little sister has come all this way to visit you, to sh so show some gratitude. Okay. Well, remember anything yet? No. You're an annoying sister. <laughs> My head hurts. Bro, you were hit by a car. Wow, I guess you really don't remember a thing. Well, I was hit by a car. Somebody's car alarm is going off, speaking of being hit by a car. Get up! You're lucky I was the first to find you. Just a little longer and you probably would have died. You could even say it's because of me being quick to call an ambulance that you were saved. How about a little thanks? Domo Arigato. Shut up. Ho bag. Huh? I mean thank you. Jeez, you're such a klutz. You wouldn't even be able to feed yourself if I wasn't around. All you do is play your online games. What's so fun about grinding levels all day? Well, you wouldn't know. What's so fun about being an annoying little bitch all day? You can't even take a bath alone. At your age? You always complain when I'm not in there with you. That's weird, man. That's just weird. <laughs> that was a joke, of course. Oh, thank goodness for that. And that look on your face said you were taking it seriously. I mean, well I wasn't because I know the secrets, but sorry for messing with you. But hey, we're siblings. Let's just get along, okay? Sure thing. Alright. No way, Jose. Yeah, whatever. I'm sorry, I forget the bad stuff because we did the good stuff last time. I hate it, but we gotta do it. I'm gonna go home now. I left you some honey milk in the fridge, so drink that and take it easy. Aw, thanks, Rikana. I'll come see you tomorrow, too. Is there anything you want me to bring you? Strawberry milk, please, would be good. Well, even if there is, I'm not gonna bring it. Wow, okay, see ya. That's my outro, don't steal my outro, go away. Jeez, how rude, I love her. She seems to be my little sister. Seems to be, yeah. Jeez, chest of drawers, there is a fridge. A fridge. oh, there's something else. A passport and seal are also in here. It looks like whoever owns this has 200 million yen, holy crap! Could it be mine? If so, it'd be bad if anyone else found out about this. I should keep this safe. 200 million yen? That's like a whole dollar! That's a lot of money. Oh yeah, that was my thing the first time I played. It was a shit ton of money, and we were just like, She's doing all our money! But she took like fraction of the money and then we kill ourselves yeah good good oh good going kantaro so stupid bro sorry back no anarchy your darling little sister is back oh aren't you sweet hey are you crying yeah i'm rich <laughs> you must have been lonely right lonely with all my money no no not at all 
Huh? You weren't? Well, that's new. Wow. Okay. Did you drink your honey milk? Yeah, well, yeah, I'm used to being alone. Yeah, that's right. I bought it with my meager allowance, you know. You better not have thrown it away or something. Surely you would have the same allowance as me, which is 200 million dollars. Oh, there's a little bit left. Don't mind if I do. Oi, that's my honey milk. Mmm, I just love the honey flavor in this. This yumminess is wasted on you. Nyaw. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Why don't we go out for a bit? Oh, uh, what? What? Go out? What do you What do you mean, go out? What? Just kidding. Why? Just for a change of pace, you know? You'll get all gloomy if you stay cooped up in here. Oh, right, yeah. Come on, let's go, let's go. Right, she meant outside, not, not out. Ow, gotcha. Were you able to remember anything? No, not a thing. I get it, I get it. Don't worry. You don't have to remember it all at once. Take your time. I kind of hope you don't get your memory back. It feels kind of refreshing being able to talk to you like this. <laughs> yeah, it does, doesn't it? We, uh, weren't really that close before. We never really talked to each other. But now that you've lost your memory, we have a chance to change all that, you know? I kind of feel like I've been able to get a little closer to you. Aww. So cute, you lying whore. I'm glad I was able to talk to you again. After all, I love you, bro. Oh, love you too, sis. Sis. Did you hard jump just now? Tad. Not really. But <laughs> it totally did, didn't it? I bet it's beating like crazy right now. I think it did the first time, but not that one. It's fluttering like crazy. Not really, yeah. No. <laughs> you really are fun to mess with. That part about you is the same with or without your memory. I guess it's one of your traits, being fun to mess with. Yeah, what a great trait. I'm starving to death here. You better treat me to something tasty. Gold digger. Come on, you're good for it, right? It's for your cute, adorable little sister, after all. No! Cheap ass. Sorry about it. Oof, maybe I should have said yeah. I feel bad now. Oh, I did it anyway. I had a meal with my sister, and none of these decisions actually matter, it just changes, like, the next thing she says. Naturally, it was her beloved ramen. Naturally, because I know this. It seemed our relationship, which had been rather cold before I lost my memory, was headed in a better direction. Yeah. Somewhere along the way, I seem to have started to pay more attention to her smiling face, as we always do at this point of the day. Got off. Pot of greed. Activate. Sorry. Anyway. Chair. It's a chair. Rikana was sitting here. Hmm. Hmm? A piece of paper has fallen under the chair. Read it? Yes. Baka 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 baka. Why does this have to happen to me? Why do I have to pay for other people's crimes? It's fucked up. This world is fucked up. Whose note could this be? For now, I'll just keep it with me. You got someone's note. Jolly good then. Guess I'll die. There she is. Oh, I love this music so much. Yo, how you been, bro? Ah, same old, same old. I'm just as great as ever. Well, I'm just as hungry as ever, too. You're hungry a lot, aren't you? Man, I'm hungry. So what's with the long face? I think you look way cuter when you're smiling. You really have a woman's face. Thanks. You even look more feminine than some girls. He does a bit, actually. So, do you have a girlfriend? I've never heard you talk about it. How would I know? I might have one. Huh? Really? I don't know. Anyway, more importantly, I came here today because I want to talk to you about something. What's that? Come on, you're gonna be helping your cute little sister wash her troubles away. Try looking a bit happier. This happy enough for you? Oh, I forgot how attractive she is. Um, so anyway, let me get serious for a minute. Don't mind if you do. Oh. Serious, Rakana. Rakana from that angle. Damn. She's not actually my sister, it's okay. Don't worry about it. I'm thinking of going to one of those smart schools. Oh yeah? Yeah, those schools where all the geniuses go. I know you're probably thinking something like you of all people. Yeah. But hey, I'm pretty smart. I've been studying hard, too. I'm sure Mom and Dad would be proud, too. I think it's a good idea. Let's be serious for a moment. Well, see, the problem is money. You're in charge of it, so I can't just use it as I please. That's why I'm always so hungry all the time. And I was thinking, well, 
I have a right to some of their money too, so I thought to talk to you about it. Well? Now, is this the final decision that matters? Or is there another after this? I'm gonna check real quick. Because I don't really want to give her all of the money if I can help it, but if I need to. I mean, I should just for the other ending, but I don't want to. I really don't, because I like Rikana. I want it to end sort of well, despite the bad ending. So I'm going to make the intelligent decision and give her only the needed amount. Because anything else would be a stupid move. Really? Thanks, bro. I knew I could count on you. Ah, no problem. Well, it was like $200,000 or something, right? That ain't much compared to the millions that I have. I'm definitely going to make something of myself and come back to save you. Count on it. Sure thing. Thanks, sis. No. So sweet, if only she were actually like that. The next day, Rikana didn't come to see me. The day after that, and the next one too. I kept waiting for her, but she never came. I was worried about her. Did she get in an accident? What kind of trouble could she have gotten herself into? Unable to sit around idly, I ran out of the hospital. I desperately searched everywhere for her, but I couldn't find her. A little while later, I began looking into my family registry. Why? I didn't have a little sister. My deceased mother and father were my only fa- What the hell?! JK, I knew that, but still! Shock horror! Closet. Closed, maybe they're mine. Hmm? There's a note in the coat pocket. Read it. Hell yeah. My mom died today. I'm all alone now. I have some money at least. Dad left it for me. I'll be okay for a while. From now on, I'll have to live on my own. It's going to be lonely, but I knew this day would come eventually. There are a lot of things written here that piqued my interest. Could I have written this before I lost my memory? You got someone's note. Do. Day 4. Mali Fiori. Several months had passed since then. Several months? Well, you must be over it now, then. I found Rikana in town. I followed Rikana so I wouldn't lose track of her, then caught up to her and forcefully grabbed her hand. Nice. Yeah, good, good call, good call. Get that money back. Or at least find out the story. Still dressed like that, huh? Merli Fioria! What? Don't touch me, you're fucking gross. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that face. Um... Probably weird. Huh? Little sister? <laughs> Are you a fucking idiot? You're still saying that stupid shit? Wow. Okay, bit rude. No need to, no need to be so- Oh, oh, oh. oh There's no fucking way I'd be your little sister, dipshit. Language, girl. Jeez, naughty. What's with that blank stare? It's really disgusting. School? <laughs> Of course that was a lie. All I wanted was your money, dumbass. I mean, you got hit by a car, you're a single loser despite being rich, and you lost your memory? And I was the first one to find you. So you bet your ass I got the idea of pretending to be your sister to get loads of money. And hey, I think I did a pretty good job. Yeah, I much prefer you like this though. Just be yourself, come on. In the end, you were the very definition of a sucker. You fell for it, hook, line, and sinker. You're joking. You're... You're joshing me. You must be joshing me. You're joking. You're joking. I can't believe my ears. Someone shut this fella up, I'm drowning in my tears. I know, even I thought it was too good to be true. But wow, people are really are easy to trick. I did even better than I expected. <laughs> the person who gets fooled is the one who's at fault. You know, back in the day, I used to be the type who got tricked all the time. So I really know how you feel. Oh man, your face right now is just so great. Do you feel like you want to die right now? Not really, but for the ending, yes, I want to die. I want to die. Oh, that's me. Okay. So, oh, here we go. Ending time. Well then, why don't you just die? Well, I might just sit. <laughs> See how you feel about that one. Right at that moment, something inside of me snapped. I... What? Pushed Rikana into the street. Huh? No! Wham!
Rikana was run over by a car. Rikana? And died. I killed Rikana. Oh, crap! That wasn't nice at all! When I came back to my senses, I was running. I don't want anyone to suspect me. It would be bad if there were any witnesses. If there happened to be any, I'd kill them. Those thoughts ran through my mind as I sprinted as fast as I could. I wondered how long I had been running, but I wasn't about to let my legs stop. My, a dazzling light filled my field of vision. Not again! The light was coming from a car. I was a fool. Both before and after losing my memory, I was a fool, I thought. Rikana, I'm sorry. I'll be there to see you soon. Bad end. Together. I like that we're together and all, but that togetherness wasn't really earned in that one. That wasn't good. You know, only her ending was better in the, um, so N Nagus's ending was... That end was better. Uh, I don't know about, um... Cafe Ole. I mean, her... Bad ending was, um, good, and that's redemption and shit, and everybody gets a second chance, but at the same time, you know, the good ending, he got killed or something, I think, so yeah. Um, this one... I don't like the true ending, I thought was really stupid. This one makes more sense, but she died, and I don't like that. And why couldn't have we just got been, you know, I could have helped her out. I had 200 million yet. Oh, I guess, what I, what I disliked about the true ending of Rikana's was that, um, he was like, I got tricked, I lost my money, I'm gonna run away and get hit by a car, I'm so upset and crying now. This time he got mad about her being a bitch and pushed her into a road. Though he did say I want to die, which is kind of stupid, I mean, why? Because you got tricked, but buck up sissy pants, you got tons of money. <laughs> like, um, so that, at that case, the running away at least made more sense, and then he got hit by a car. Um, I don't think he died in the first one, I'm not sure, it wasn't really clear. But, yeah, but Rikana dying? Not good, not good. If we got up, like, I wanted to help Rikana in the first one. I think in the ending, if you chose the other option, she went on and told her backstory a bit, and was like, I'm poor, you know, I got tricked out of all my money or some shit, and hot, bad upbringing, and I was like, ah, oh, yeah, I get that, sure. That's, that's okay. I take my, I don't care, I take my money, <laughs> go for it, um, whatever. <laughs> wasn't that much anyway, compared to the millions that he had. So I was like, alright, sure, whatever, I guess. Um, but, yeah, that that one made more sense in this case. But yeah, the true ending was just sort of like, why did you do that? You should still have tons. I'm gonna actually, um, Google now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hop into Googs, the Googs, and search up true ending. If Kantaro decides he doesn't want to die, Rikana just sneers and tells him she refuses to turn the money to him. She admits that because her father is in debt, it affected her life. Yeah, 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 and sad story, blah, blah, blah. Shouldn't have stole, but, you know, no need to run away and cry like a baby. So, um, let me, let me, what am I going to look up? Expensive uni in Japan. Japan's top two universities, 535,000 yen per year. $4,000 per year. Most programs, undergraduate, master levels plus an additional 282,000 admission fee okay okay that is quite a lot oh geez he would only have like 500,000 yen left over wouldn't he wait no 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 he wouldn't no he wouldn't he had 200 million yen that's stupid numbers okay that is stupid high let me get out the calculator here calcul I don't even need a calculator but but let's assume um, she got, like, a friggin' master's degree. That's five years, right? Five times five is 25. So two and a half million yen for a master's degree. Even for a PhD, that's, like, what, an extra two years? So another million. That's, like, three to four million yen at most. You would have a hundred 
and six a hundred uh, not sorry 196 million yen left over did i do my math right is that someone check me on that plus the admission fee of 282,000 yen yeah whatever so what like yeah three to four million yen but you have 200 million yen left over that's the thing because i didn't give her all of the money because that would be retarded I just gave her the money that she needed, and that's the money she needs for the most expensive school in Japan. I'm assuming it's in Japan. But let's go for, like, best university in the world. Harvard. I fought as much. Harvard university fees. Average cost after aid, $16,000. Okay, the average cost to go to Harvard is $16,000. So, I assume that's US dollars. Um, USD to yen, one million six hundred and ninety-seven thousand six hundred and thirty-two yen on average to go to Harvard. We would not like. We, that's tiny. <laughs> that's. I mean, it's not tiny. That's huge. But <laughs> that's that's compared to the two hundred million yen that I had in game. That is tiny. That's like one percent of it. If my math is. That's half, barely, that's almost, almost 1% of the amount of money that I had. Yeah, yeah, that's severely underestimated. 200, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3 zeros. That is in US dollars. Really? That's it? Those are rookie numbers, rookie numbers. There we go, that's better. I was going to say. <laughs> I put in uh, two, 2 million yen, sorry, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so... 200 million yen is one, is nearly 2 million US dollars. Like, that's shit ton. If you're good with money, which I assume he is since he has a rich father, so I hope so, rich parents, um, then yeah, like he's... T the money he gave for college is not, not shit, but what? <laughs> that's not, that's like 2%, 2%, 2 at 1% of his money. So it's like, oh yeah, whatever. Like, this is exactly what I said in the first time, I. I played the game and played that, that, um, Rikana's route, but, like, just these baby numbers. These baby numbers compared to the amount that he had, which was 200 million. Ah, it pisses me off. It makes me so annoyed that all that shit happened because he gave away 1% of his money. I'll be like if you had $100 and gave away a dollar. <laughs> I'd be like, oh no, this chick scammed me out of a whole dollar. Oh, my life is ruined. I'm gonna jump in front of a car. Wah, wah. I'm such a poor boy. No. No. It's one, it's one dollar, man. Like, come on. Come on. Money is everything. My foot, like, come on. That's so stupid. That's so, I mean, I get it. Like, Kantaro shocked to hear, I'm reading from the wiki, that um she just used him and didn't care about him, walks out onto the road. But, like, bro. Get over it. It's been like several months. Like, I understand you'd be upset, but come on. Come on. Come on. Oh my, that's so dumb. Like, you could. <laughs> my response to that, to her being like, ah, I'm mocking you. <laughs> I took all your. I took your money. I was using you. And I'll just be like, could I just ask? It's like, okay. What? <laughs> so, what? You took like a whole dollar from me. I, I don't care if you were using me. Um, want to go on a date like uh that would just probably be a bit of a gold digger but no you could touch into her feelings and then it would work out because i quite like Rikana. i do i very i very much like her i think she has the best story she's got an actual realistic sob story you know i suppose um i you know did as well but she just went looney tunes and nagisa is the yandere she's great and all i love nagisa um she's probably yeah she, she's great i love her don't get me wrong but like, um, um, Rikana is the most realistic, and I, I, like, I feel that, the realism of it, and so I'm just like, oh yeah, she's great, I like her, she's best girl, and so it's like, <laughs> like, I would make it, I would just be like, okay, but <laughs> you took like a whole dollar from me, I don't care, well, um, how about I, you want some help, I can help you out, like, I ain't no simp, I'm smart with my money, but like, She's a, she's a great girl, deep down. You could tell she's got some good in her. And we can bring that out. <clears throat> Maybe. We'll see. 
If I knew her in real life, I could tell more, but I'm pretty sure. Obviously, she's not a real person, but you know, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I am very good at telling what people are like, so if I actually saw her in real life, I could tell if she was worth it or not. Um, but yeah, so that's what annoys me about Rikana's route, is that that's so stupid. The ending is just so stupid, just like, you gave away 1% of your money. <laughs> she can go to Harvard now <laughs> with that. <laughs> and go to Harvard with 1% of your money and it wouldn't even affect you. You could still don't even need to work with that amount of money. With that much money, you do not need to. You still have like $2 million. Or like 190. Well, what, $1.9 million. Like, that's too much for anyone. Um, so unless you're really stupid with your money, then you're fine. Like, you're set for life. Who cares? Help her out. Marry her. It'll be great. <laughs> like, but... Don't be a sugar daddy, but like, you know, help her out, make her a better person, teach her stuff, and actually put her in Harvard, that'd be pretty cool. But you know, whatever. What do I know? I don't make games. Thank you. I ranted up out that for like 10 minutes. Sorry. We cut some of that out. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts as always down in the comments. This is the final episode of Mix or Ray. Sad times, I know, but we still got more games by Charon because I, I very much I enjoyed Mix or Ray. Full and through and through, but all endings, and it was short and sweet, very nice, well, I say sweet, short and good, <laughs> um, yeah, so more games by Charon would be pretty cool, and we got more games coming, we got plenty of ideas coming, oh, this guy actually got quite a lot of games, cool, ooh, they look very nice, ooh, yeah, you can't see what I'm looking at, anyway, thank you all so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed, my name has been Sankara, and until next time, see ya.